Um, Sarah had asked me, let's see, do archangels, Jesuses, and Jehovah know that there is 5D and beyond? No, they do not. Uh, many of the 4D people, entities, especially at the top of 4D, unless it's real close, they really believe that they're, you know, right below source. They're right outside of source. They do not know that there's the rest of it. Any more than most 3D humans knew that there was anything else here. Uh, it's part of the amnesia and it's part of the game. They have to keep that amnesia in, in order to play that game. Then she asks, um, she's concerned about asking for help. Okay. There's a difference between asking for an entity to do it for you and asking for help. If you ask for help, help on learning how to do something, help from getting from here to there, clarification on an issue, there will always be your team. And there are so many of them and it's so complex that it's hard to explain. I am not going to say things like guardian angels. I say my pub friends and by pub friends, I mean my my, they're kind of the leaders of the team because the team that is working with you is bigger than you can possibly imagine. And it's multi-layered. It's very, very complex. But kind of my pub friends, they're my closest ones. They're the ones that um, I have the most direct contact with. And there are fewer of them. Uh, there's a smaller amount of them, so it's easier for me to talk to. But there, in truth, there are, uh, because we are all one, so it's kind of like the body. The human body works, even though there are independent, separate systems that are in place, they all work together. And ultimately, that's how we are. Because your little life right here is just one part of the big all that is oneness, and it is very, very complex. Ultimately, we are all connected to everything, and we are all one. So, ultimately, uh, everything is here to help and assist you. The difference is <clears throat> in whether or not you're asking to have something or someone do it for you, or if you are asking for assistance or clarification. If you say it from the standpoint of you want assistance, or you want clarification, or you want to learn how to do something, that then you'll have no problem whatsoever. The second that you say, I give up, I can't do this, just come in and do it for me, I give you my power, if you'll just save me. Uh, that is where you'll stay in 5D. Uh, because 5D is all about giving your power, just like 3D was giving a very physical power. 4D is more giving your power on a, on a more energetic level. But <clears throat> when you do that, when you give up, <clears throat> your power and say somebody else fix it for me <clears throat> the only way that you can do that is if you do not believe that you are a creator god and are capable of doing it yourself and if you are at that point which is fine there's nothing wrong with it then you will not be going to 5d because this is a very responsible creator gods consciously learning to create um, and remembering who they are that are on that plane so if you're wanting somebody else to do it for you, then that will be a 3D move. If you're asking for clarification or t or learning in any way, you can just keep asking and the right entities, the right situation will always be there to help you. It doesn't really matter who is answering it. You don't really need to name them guardian angels or pub friends or twin flames or soulmate or whatever it is that you want. You don't need to name them at all because it's so complicated that it will just cause more problems. If you name them, then you're simply saying, I want an answer and I want this particular part of the equation to answer the question. Whether, rather than if you say, hey, I'm a creator God, I'm part of the whole, I want this clarified, I want to know how, end of story, then you leave that open for the most efficient, effective way of getting the answer. If you insist that it be drawn through a certain line, education, religion, money, archangels, channeling, art. If you insist that your answer comes just through a certain way, then the universe, because you're a creator of God, must comply. And that may be the most difficult way that you get information. So if you want information, just simply say, hey, I got this. It's complicated, but I'm a creator of God. 
I want clarification on this. Ask for clarification. If you feel like you've got an answer, but you still don't get it, then just ask for more. Ask for more. Ask for more. But I would encourage you to not identify a certain person that you want the information from or a certain route because it really limits um, the most effective, efficient, quickest way for you to get the answer that you crave. Okay? Does that make sense? All right. I think that was everything in there. All right, love. Uh, huge hugs. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you later. Bye now.